so no bait on. No bait, no life bait. I, I'm a big, uh, in my community, I like to preach to go away from life bait. I like the the fact that you're using your, you choose a bait and you try to get going and you find a pattern really. Um, I'm sure live bait with those fish is great. That's what I've been reading, like uh, smelt or or live bait. You can get a lot of fish going. So when you landed this thing, um, did you know, like you said, you it was the biggest fish you'd ever seen. Were you pretty sure that you had a record? Yeah. In the video, you can see it. Like when we pulled it out of the water, my friend saw me excited. I said, Steve, you got to come here in it right now. Steve's a local guy there uh, in Sim on Simcoe as well. I said, you got to come here right now. And he's like, oh, Sebastian, you know, it's probably just a small fish. Don't don't exaggerate. I said, Steve, you, you got to come. It's big. And we pulled it out, and I looked at him. I said, Steve, that's the record. So we had doubts. You always have doubts. And, and I'm a big catch and release uh, guy. I like to release everything. I don't like killing things. Um, sometimes I'll keep perch to eat. But I looked at Steve, and I said, listen, I, I got to go get a scale. I want to clear it off my mind. First, we went and got a scale. I got some gentlemen that were fishing close to us. They brought a scale. The scale was decent. It weighed in at uh, 18.3 ounces. Um, and we measured it. So Steve was looking on this phone. He was looking at the record of the gentleman you spoke with. And we compared that. Out. His was 36. Mine was 38 and a half, almost 39. Um, the girdle on my fish was 19. So... I called Will Wegman, who's uh, who works for the Ministry of Natural Resources. He's got a, a good values uh, in the area. He knows Simcoe very well, and uh, he gave, gave me the step by step on what to do: keep the fish, keep you know. So we we harvested the fish, and it'll be given away to the uh, OFA. to uh, the Ministry of Natural Resources uh, here in Aurora, uh, quite the drive, snowing a lot up north, I hate, I hate the city traffic, I don't know how you guys live here, god damn it, some guys in Audis that don't have the I guess they didn't buy the option of using the flasher or something. I don't know, man. It doesn't. Fuck. Backy. Got... So we're rolling into Ministry of Natural Resources detachment. Oh, they got a pond over there. Probably loaded with fish. So. I'll try to film as much as possible. Ah, uh, here's the MNR. That's the MNR truck right here. Dirty. It's good to see that they're being used. An undercover one. I, I like that. Bastion. Uh, well, you don't mind if I film me? Eh? No, no, that's right. Yeah, you're all about this. Okay. <laughs> it's filming right now. Yeah. Okay, cool. Bring it up here. That thing smells. Does it? Well, even when it was alive, it smelled. <laughs> yeah, it's good, man. They do that. Oh, it's not even frozen. Good. Out of boy. Yeah. Gotta preserve some of that snow. Yeah. Um, God, the gills are even red still. <laughs> they might crazy. still be alive. <laughs> they might still be alive. I don't know. Wow. Man, that looks bigger than in the video. <laughs> yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. Let's uh. This is even <laughs> long it's enough. enough. Yeah, I measured it twice. Once it. It's, yeah, it's not long it's, enough. Like, it's, it's bigger than 38. 
Oh yeah. Inches. It, I got a tape if you want. Sure, let's do it. Just, I mean, we don't have to do that. And for the record keeping, uh, we just have to verify that it's a burbot. So there's the notch. That's a distinguishing characteristic. The two, the dorsals. Right? Mm -hmm. We all see that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And that has that triangular part to it as opposed to flat. So I left the tape at my house. Okay, no sweat. It's it's definitely a burbot. <laughs> we can get the musky board out of the Yeah, if you really want. Yeah. You guys, you can keep the fish if you want. No, no, you got to keep it, I think, for, for they them. They told me I don't need it much. Really? The advanced wants to keep it. Yeah. 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 It, 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 it's not yellow no more. It used to be super, super yellow. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. No teeth to speak yeah. of on the tongue or... No. Yeah, no. I grabbed it by the gill and I saw Steve put his ends in there. I'm like, okay, I guess they got no teeth. Yeah, yeah. There's the burble. Yeah, he's got some more there too. Like he's got one here. Yeah. I feel I felt bad keeping it. Line, eh? Yeah, yeah. Just like a cod. Yeah. Just like a cod. <laughs> yeah. This might give us, can we get this wet a little bit? Oh, absolutely. Uh, just to get yep, the yep. girth. Because I had 19 at home. Yeah, see, I got more than 19 oh, here. Well, I got 19 pretty much. Yeah. Yeah. 19. Yeah. You can have that. I'll get more. Yep. <laughs> we'll hold it together. I don't want to stink. <laughs> We'll all get in it. Come on, everyone. Yeah. Hey, I'll take the picture. Yeah. <laughs> no, get in here. I'll just stand behind him. He kissed the cod. Come on, he grows up by French. That's a freaking big ling, man. That's yeah, a new record. No kidding. Yeah. Wow, where'd he catch it? Simco. I was gonna say, yeah. Yeah. where else? Oh, no, no. Congrats, yeah, man. Thank you. Yeah, it'll be interesting to see if those gobies are yeah. 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 Oh, no, yeah. Probably. So what are you yeah. gonna do with it? Uh, I had to harvest it to get the right. I was gonna release it. Yeah. 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 I'm gonna send a text back to the I'll get my baby guys I like those garments. That's a good problem. Yeah. Oh yeah, you want to see it? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, it's okay. <laughs> I, you might have to sign this to say I got a fishing license. he put it in the book for you? Yeah, it's a record. Yeah. This fish. Thank you. I never keep this, but no. Yeah. That's it's an old fish. Yeah. Gonna be here for a while. Uh, I'm leaving soon. <laughs> okay. Can I run up and grab my phone? To yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead. So, um, what was I mentioning? So, getting the record certified. Let's track back. Picture on a clear measuring tape. Not the the fish can't be on the measuring tape. It has to be. The measuring tape has to be visible so you can see all the letters, all the all the writing on the measuring tape, all the numbers. Um, 
so people don't cut the measuring tape and mail up here longer. Uh, so I use two measuring tape on mine. I have somebody witness that. He's got a sign on here, the measurement. Uh, we need to have certified government certified scale. So government sticker on it within 365 days of the certification. <coughs> Sorry. That'll be your hardest part. Finding somebody will allow you to use that. So don't give up. You already harvested the fish. Don't give up. Find a place. Those records are meant to be broken. And I guarantee you that record's been broken before. People just didn't know. They want to go through the process. It's a lengthy process. So um, we'll go forward with that. I got my application again. We'll send that in. Uh, so as I was saying, there's three records. The way it works with the OFAH is you have 45 days after a year. So meaning January 1st to, to December 31st is a year. So right now we're in 2017. January 1st, there's still 45 days of allowance. You have 45 days after, after the year to submit in your record for 2016. You get what I'm saying? So right now, the record in the books is 15.88. Uh, I don't know where it's caught. And then there's a potential record, the, the kid that caught it in uh, Jesse Lake in Thunder Bay, or that area, caught a 16.8 bowfin. It was 37 inch long, or 36, 37 inch long. That is the potential new record. If somebody this year, I think within the next few days, this is submitted uh, a bourbon, which I doubt they will for two, that they caught last year in 2016. So my record won't come official because somebody can beat it. It won't come official until about this time next year. You know, 45 days after 2017. If somebody doesn't beat it, then my record becomes official. So and I. With the way it's fishing right now, it's probably not gonna hold. There's bigger ones out there. I wouldn't say much bigger ones. You know, I, I don't think Simcoe or, or any other lake out here can uh, sustain much bigger fish growth than this. But, uh, yeah, we'll give it a shot. We'll see. You know, you never know, so I might as well send it in. <laughs> 